And our correspondent Siddhant is joining us with more details on the story. Uh, Siddhant, first give us details about the way in which the International Court will proceed with the hearing today. Important day for uh, India uh, and of course uh, Pakistan as they face off each other at the International Court of Justice uh, at the Hague. And a lot of things will be at stake India as like Pakistan to the International Court after many decades. The last time was it, it was in 1970s. But of course, Pakistan died India in 1999 over shooting down of his aircraft. At that time, India had said that uh, Pakistan has no jurisdiction over uh, the international court has no jurisdiction over the issue, and India won. Pakistan is now likely to use that same old technique, saying that uh, that uh, the International Court of Justice has no jurisdiction. But that uh, might not uh, work because India has dragged Pakistan on account of uh, Vienna Convention, under which uh, consular access has to be given to the citizen of a country. Pakistan, remember, has not uh, given Kulbhushan Yadav's consular access to India. India has almost tried 16 times for consular access. There seems to be something fishy from the Pakistani side, primarily because there is no charge sheet. The Pakistanis are delaying on visa part for the mother of Kulbhushan Yadav, who, who, who wants to go to Pakistan to file the appeal and all, obviously follow the proceedings there. So uh, fearing that, uh, that the life of Kulbhushan Yadav might be at stake, India had to go to the Kulbhushan Yadav, uh, for, uh, to the International Court of Justice for Kulbhushan Yadav. Remember, this is a deviation in the foreign policy, but it shows how, how strongly India stands for its citizens when it comes to hmm. saving them uh, when they are uh, stuck uh, in the foreign land. Uh, India Julie says that there should not be a third party uh, mediation when India and Pakistan have some problem and it should be solved bilaterally. But this is for the first time India is going to the International Court of Justice to save its citizen Kulbhushan Yadav. Now, uh, uh, there, uh, there were fears on the, uh, on the life of Kulbhushan Yadav. India does not know the location, the health of Kulbhushan Yadav. And India had taken all the, all the other measures, including hoping that uh, some lawyers from Lahore or Islamabad might file the appeal. But uh, uh, as we saw in the media from Pakistan, that they had given the Lahore Bar Association had given a strict warning saying that no lawyer right. should defend him. So obviously, India had to go for this. And remember, Pakistan was somehow expecting this move because just 10 days before Kulbushan Yadav, uh, this announcement came that he will be hanged. Maliha Lodi, who is the permanent representative of Pakistan at the United Nations, had changed the declaration at right, the International Court of Justice, saying that under Clause E, uh, national security, the International Court of Justice jurisdiction does not apply to Pakistan. But we are all have to wait for 1.30 uh, p.m. when the, the hearing starts from the India side. Right, Sadan, thank you very much for joining us with those inputs. Uh, this afternoon, the hearing will start, where India will try and defend Mr. Kuldeep uh, Jadav.